Hey guys, so today I want to do a quick little video showing how to take a screenshot, screen capture, or like a screen print or something with the brand new Samsung Galaxy S5. Uh, and this is not going to be hard at all. Um, probably the same procedure as we have been using on um, on other devices. There are probably multiple ways you can do this, but the most basic one is, of course, hold in the home button, hold in also the power button here on the side, and uh, do this at the same time. And there you go. Takes a screenshot, saves the screenshots up here. You also get a notification, and you, when it's ready, you see screenshot captured. You can just go down here from the top to bring uh, bring this up. Uh, and and then what you can do here, you can either delete it automatically. So let's try that. And it will ask you if you want to delete it, and now it will disappear. Um, and then there are also some other things you can do, some options. There are also some other ways to take a screenshot, uh, with probably with your hand or something, uh, and maybe a bunch of other ways, but uh, this is probably the basic one that you want to know. Uh, so then they also have an option to share it. So you can share it by text, uh, like SMS or something, like messages, Hangouts, Google Hangouts, Bluetooth, so most uh, smartphones have Bluetooth, so that's probably an easy way. Gmail, or use normal email if you have another email account, Flipboard, Chown, uh, you can upload it to Google Drive, uh, so you can save it online. Um, you can actually also insert it in a memo. And there's just a ton of other ways to share it. I mean, they kind of have all the different ways here that you probably need to know about. And then, of course, another thing you can do here is edit it. So if you tap on edit, uh, you have a bunch of things you can do in here. Uh, so you can do some simple adjustments here, like make it smaller. And you can see here, they show you a tutorial the first time you do this. You just click on done up here when you're ready or use console. And uh, you can rotate it as well, so pretty great there. Very, very cool uh, animation here when you're rotate, rotating and stuff. I'm um, just going to console that. Uh, you have some other ways here also. Why is it always... Yeah, you can make it green. And a bunch of other colors as well. That is random. Contrast and brightness if you want to need to increase that a little bit. You can also select an area here and decide what you want to do with it. And I mean, there's a bunch of other things you can explore it yourself. So uh, uh, use a quick little basic view at that effects, some pre default effects here. that would change what's going on and you can have a cool little thing that's going on there in the corner so yeah just quickly look at that how we do it and pull off so peace out